Hello friends and greetings from Iceland. We have a new eruption which started at 3.55 in the morning. I was sleeping, I missed the beginning of this eruption. And it started in the best possible location, very much north, actually almost in the same location as last August and September, to the very north, in the safest area possible. Let's take a look at the map of the eruption. The fissure currently is about one kilometer long. And as you see, it's very far north of Grindavik. It's right next to Fagradalsfjall, west of Fagradalsfjall. And most of the lava is going to the east in the preferable direction in totally wild areas where there is no infrastructure, nothing. So it's very good news for ice and it's very good news for residents of Grindavik and Blue Lagoon. And also for the airport and the airport highway as it's in neutral location and does not disturb anybody. Currently, all the roads um, to the area are closed, but you can easily see the eruption from airport or highway when you are driving. We hike it to this area from Vogar, from intersection in Vogar, last September when we had eruption in the same place. So it's well visible from airport highway. But one can't access Grindavik or the Grindavik road or Gulagun, everything is closed in the area. This is the view from the airport highway from Vogar. You have a lot of um, smoke, uh, mainly from wildfires, because there is lots of vegetation in the area, and also from the volcano itself. Lots of pollution, uh, volcanic gas pollution, which is driven to the north, towards Kaplovin, by the way. And this is how the eruption looks uh, right now, uh, live from uh, Vogar. The road to the front is the airport highway, and as you see, it's open and you can drive to the airport safely. And this is the map of the pollution from the volcano. As you see, the winds are pushing it north. It's very cloudy and foggy in the area. You can see the volcano from live camps for now, but uh, we will keep you updated on the situation. Here you can see some pictures of the eruption taken by Icelandic Coast Guard helicopter right when it started. In the background you can see Litla Skokfat mountain and slightly to the left in the background it's Stora Skokfat mountain. The lava which is spilling to the front is moving towards Fagradals Fjall to the east. And to the front uh, right, you can see how lava is flooding the new areas to the very north. This is the northernmost eruption of all, or very close to the northernmost edges of the lava. Now, uh, four hours after the eruption started, it was reported that the fissure expanded to 1.5 um, kilometers long and the cracks are in diagonal direction uh, one after another it's not just one fish you have multiple cracks there as you see and how long it will last very hard to say perhaps a week or two as it had been the case uh, with all with most of the eruptions in this area but considering that the fissure is rather small 1.5 kilometer comparing let's say, to seven that we had before, and the amount of magma is not that big, I suspect it will be very brief eruption, perhaps a week or some days. That's my guess. So those are the major news from Iceland. Uh, be well and God bless.